so Natalie is the number one fan of Knight Rider. Anything Natalie goes into, she does it to the ultimate. Hi, my name is Natalie Marshall and I'm a huge fan of the television show Knight Rider and David Hasselhoff is my hero. September 26, 1982 on NBC. Main characters on Knight Rider are Michael Knight, he's the main star. Aloha. And there's Devin Miles, he runs the foundation. Uh, Bonnie Barstow is the mechanic who takes care of Kit. <laughs> Kit is the talking car. I'm a car, not a plane. Knight Rider just always stood out to me. It was just a, a well-rounded show. Cheers! I've been a Knight Rider fan since I was three years old in 1982 when the series started. Natalie first took an interest in Knight Rider when she was three years old when the show first started. And she had such a fascination with the car and she just loved the show. Just it had a lot of action, it had good morals, it was fun to watch. And there's not too many other shows that really grabbed my attention the way Knight Rider did. David's always been my hero. And what I really love the most about him is his good heart because he does so much work for terminally ill children. He's always there for his fans. He always stops to sign autographs, take pictures, and he really has an interest in people. And that's something that I think is really nice about him. When I was in high school, we moved away from my hometown for three and a half years, and I was kind of depressed. During that time, Knight Rider really helped me a lot. I would come home and Knight Rider would be on television, and I remember watching that a lot after school during those couple of years. And, and it just really, it was a kind of a, a major key in, in kind of helping me get through. Well, my fandom started, uh, I guess, when I was seven, and I got the Knight Rider car on my birthday. Well, she was really excited. Uh, she was, she had been wanting the car, so my husband and I surprised her with it. I don't think Natalie's interest in Knight Rider is over too much because it's uh, just a, a hobby. Dave is my favorite star, and I really enjoy the collecting and being able to share things like on the internet with my friends and on my website. I had the Viewmaster reels, and I had stickers, and then as I got a little older, I started collecting more things. I started in a toy book. Uh, with toy dealers and then I got on the internet and that's when it really took off collecting. Just about anything I see or find I have to buy it. Over here I have my David Hasselhoff autographs that some really good friends of mine in Europe got for me. This poster is actually really rare. This is actually of a kit replica. It's not one from the show but uh, it's a really rare poster that not too many people have. I've collected various buttons over the years. I have them displayed in different parts of the room. And I have all the Knight Rider series on DVD. I went out and bought every season on its release day. So I have all those lined up there with my photographs. I have something really rare behind the door. It's a Knight Rider flag from Germany. Whenever there's something I cannot find over here, there's always somebody in Europe that I can ask for help to find things. This one right here is an original uh, metal die cast car that is also from the 80s. This right here is the Japanese remote control car and this one I really like because when you turn this one on, this one has a scanner that lights up on it. This is the original Knight Rider air freshener. I actually have another one of these hanging in my car. They kind of smell like potpourri. This is something really rare. This is a paper of the world hits when it shows David's single Looking for Freedom when it was number one in 1989. Sometimes I feel like I've collected just about everything there is to collect and then I find all this other stuff. Well, to collect memorabilia is very important to me and uh, it makes me feel really good when I can walk into my room and, and just see everything that's displayed around there. and just kind of puts a certain vibe into the room, I, I guess. Because it just gives atmosphere to what's going on in my life. I'm a web and graphic designer, and I love to work on websites, so I'm one of those people that uh, somebody wants a website, they come contact me, and I will do the website to their specifications and the graphics too. That looks really good. Thanks. I have an online That's fan club, so the David Hasselhoff Club of America, and right now we're almost up to 3,000 members. My ultimate goal with the website project is just to basically have the best David Hasselhoff site out there for David and for the fans and I know David is aware of my website. I've been told by a lot of people that he does visit my website and he does like it. 
I hope to one day to be able to meet David in person because that's something I've wanted to do ever since I was a young child. So I wanted to put a new one from that. If I hadn't taken an interest in Knight Rider, that I don't think I would be as into the computer as I am. My website is very important to me because I think it's my chance to give something back to David because he deserves a big fan site dedicated to him because he's worked so hard and, and because there's so many fans out there that love David and I love sharing what I've collected with other fans and I've had so many people email me and they say thank you for putting this up, I've never seen this before. It's very nice to see someone that will share so much with the community. The biggest purchase that we made for Manly was on her 23rd birthday. We bought her a Firebird, surprised her with a Firebird. She had been wanting a real replica of a Knight Rider car, and she was getting ready to go to school. So we surprised her. They knew how much I really wanted a kit car, and so they got me the next best thing, which was a brand new Firebird. It was kind of almost surreal as if it wasn't happening until we actually got there in the dealership and when they washed it and they drove it out and I realized I was going to get to take that home it was just like a dream come true. I had a big smile on my face. I was smiling all day from that car. <laughs>